Let me do this if I could. I'd like to sort of start by putting some context on all of this. Today, if I'd left this auditorium and went out and started talking to students and simply asked them one question, who are the leaders on campus? Inside of about five minutes, I would be able to develop what I would call a picture of who the leaders are and what they do. Today, we really have two objectives. Uh, the first one, we're going to try and have a little bit of fun. I've got some silly activities. I hope you enjoy them. The second thing, though, is perhaps the most difficult challenge that I experience as I talk with young people about leadership. I am going to ask you to try and change how you think about who the leaders are and what they're supposed to do on campus. So let's go ahead and have some fun. Let me give you the very first change. Here it is. Almost always, as I talk with students and say, who are the leaders on campus, the most common answer that I get is they list people that have titles. So here's the first change. Your role next year on campus will not be defined by the position you hold. Your role on campus is going to be defined by the choices that you make and the actions that you're willing to take. And let me give you the second change. And the second change is significant because it has to do with what your job is. Your job as a leader is to influence populations. It's to take a group of students from here and move them over here. Leaders are the ones that impact and influence groups of people. And here's the challenge, and here's the change. Leadership is not about you. It's not about the leader. Every once in a while, I'll run into a school, and I'll talk to a student and say, well, why did you, why did you choose to become a, a proctor? Why did you put your application? I have two schools now where I've gotten the exact same response. I love this response. Girl looked at me, and she goes like this, oh, that's easy. Proctors get refrigerators in their rooms. And I'm like, <laughs> really? <laughs> it's not about me. It's not about my success. It's not about my ideas. It's about the success of the team, the dorm, the school. It's about service. And I'm here to tell you that's a totally radical way of looking at what your job is as a leader. So here's the challenge. Right now in your brain, you have a definition of what a good year is. If you leave here and you go out and you talk to freshmen, if you talk to juniors, whatever grade you want, fifth form, it doesn't matter, and say, what's a good year? They will all have a definition of a good year. Leaders are the ones that raise the bar. Leaders are the ones that dream big dreams. Leaders are the ones that say, what if, and, and why not? So here's my challenge. Make good choices. Build good friendships. Be a positive influence in your school. Set your goals high and dream big. And create a memory that will last a lifetime.